Okay, we have just finished watching the presidential debates here tonight. And during the uh, viewing, we were practicing a meditation where we would be sending positive energy to uh, help in the United States right now at this time. And we are asking the question of, do we think that our efforts were beneficial? Were we helping? I guess to start, that was without a doubt one of the most uh, different meditations that I've ever done. And it was different because, I guess first we had, I don't usually focus on a people or a group of people or something so specific or something that there's so many other people watching and experiencing all at once. Because that was a huge event. There was a huge part of the consciousness of not only America, but parts of the world that are influenced by what's happening. And, um, and a large part of their lives may change based on the decisions that are made from whoever and ultimately becomes the president. And at the same time, there is this feeling that also is kind of running like a deep vein through all of this that feels like it's all rigged anyways. So what's really the value of what's going on here? You know, it doesn't matter who is going to get elected or it's already been decided. So it's already going to be one, you know, it's, it's already decided. There's a tremendous value to meditation, to creating smooth, mental ripples through the thoughtosphere that is intimately connected by all of us. We, we all experience it together and we, we have advanced our ability to make those connections through the internet. Did it help? Well, I mean, I hope so. <laughs> I don't really know how many people there were meditating in, in the very, in, in the smallest kind of microscopic way in the way that, the, that we see in the quantum experiments where you're your thoughts have demonstrated to affect reality? Definitely. To what degree? That is the, that is the question. Because it's possible that our meditation really mostly benefited us. Part of the intention behind the meditation was to yes, yeah, support in the awareness and the awakening of humanity and the consciousness of America. In addition to that, I found an, an added intention, which was trying to help the presidential candidates to wake up as well. I, I would find myself in the meditation putting a lot of focus into creating a space of emotional support for these two stiff, rigid people who have really hard energy running like, it's like the heart's not really connected, and then from there down, it's hard. <laughs> my, my meditation that I was doing and that I posted on the event page was to create a Merkaba at the event. And originally I was thinking underground the event with the big pyramid over top of it, and that's largely what happened. But through the course of the meditation, I found more that the, the, the Merkaba was up in the middle of the pyramid. And then from there, more specifically, I would go into like focusing on you know, Donald Trump or Hillary Clinton and, and kind of spinning a Merkaba between their heart and their root. And like, and then like kind of almost like wrapping around them and giving them hugs. Like, and like just like being really like love, just love, like tons and tons of love because they don't have any. And also for, and then like also the, that, emanating to everybody who's watching to like see the bigger picture because in the awareness of love you also see truth because truth is love and when you when you know when you know the truth then you can see through the bullshit and they're talking a lot of bullshit so it's really like a help it's it was like through this meditation we could create awareness like sparks of awareness and realizations of truth in the form of love or love in the form of truth amongst each other and the people that we're focused on because whether they like it or not, they are and have become symbols of consciousness, um, symbols of ideas. They represent ideas and thoughts. And when people vote, they're voting for, they're voting on ideas. It was interesting because after, after the meditation ended, we, all, all four of us were like, Wow, like that was heavy. Like, like it was, it started really good and like really clear with like, a, a, just like a, like we got this, you know, we got the Merkava, we got the energy, we're all doing our meditations, we're in it. And then like two thirds of the way through, it got really hard. 
I, I had the experience myself of, of being like, I want to get up and go. <laughs> Because I'm done like this is this is ridiculous and then of course I just like let my ego kind of have its moment and then keep meditating and it actually did pick up uh, Towards the end, but I was and I, I, I bounced between all sorts of different things like you know Like being with the people in the audience creating a you know a field around The audience and then the country and then the planet and then bringing it back I know in my heart especially afterwards. I know on some level it made a difference and I think we need to increase the amount of people who are meditating and that we will see even more results because we can do anything.